Well, good afternoon and good day. I hope that you're all having a wonderful time. I want to share with you a couple of ideas about this coming Sunday's gospel reading. It's about John the Baptist, who the gospel says was in the desert or in the wilderness. And he is saying, prepare for the coming of the Lord. Prepare the way for the Lord. And then he is baptizing people. And I think these three ideas are the ones that are most important at this particular time. When we think about John the Baptist being in the wilderness or in the desert, it should remind us of the Moses story and the people traveling for 40 years through the wilderness to come to the promised land. In a sense, John the Baptist is traveling to the promised land. Why? Because the Lord is coming the master, the one who will free us and give us new life. And thirdly, it seems to me that the notion of baptism is important for all of us because we have been baptized. And there are three different dimensions to baptism, which I think help us prepare for the coming of the Lord. When we're baptized, we are told that we're baptized into Christ as priest, as prophet, and king. So how is it that we are preparing as a priest to give worship and praise to God for his many blessings? How is it that as a prophet, we are speaking words of hope and healing and new life to all we meet? And finally, how is it that as a person who is baptized into the Lord's kingship or into his leadership, that we are preparing to speak up and to say what we need in our church and how we as a church, a community of people, can become God's beloved people. So it seems to me that these three ideas of being in the wilderness, of preparing the way of the Lord, and of baptism help us celebrate in a wonderful way this coming weekend. May the peace of the Lord be with you.